else. Oh, I'm a vegetarian, no, except for fish and the occasional steak. I love steak. <laughs> The hair products are Sheldon's. Okay. Um, can I ask you a favor? A favor? Sure, you can ask me a favor. I would do you a favor for you. It's okay if you say no. Oh, I'll probably say yes. It's just not the kind of thing you ask a guy you just met. Wow. We have a combined IQ of 360. We should be able to figure out how to get into a stupid building. What do you think their combined IQ is? Just grab the door! <laughs> Leonard. What? My mom bought me those pants. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're going to have to call her. You're not done with her, are you? Our babies will be smart and beautiful. Not to mention imaginary. Yes. For God's sake, Sheldon, do I have to hold up a sarcasm sign every time I open my mouth? You have a sarcasm sign? No, I do not have a sarcasm sign. And what kind of doctor removes shoes from asses? Depending on the depth, that's either a proctologist or a general surgeon. Oh. I admire your fingering. Thank you. Maybe sometime you can try that on my instrument. <laughs> if you're up for it, we could practice that middle section again. Uh, sure, why not? Just so we're clear, you understand that me hanging back to practice with you is a pretext for letting you know that I'm sexually available. <laughs> I'm good to go. I thought you weren't interested in me. That was before I saw you handling that beautiful piece of wood between your legs. You mean my cello? No, I mean the obvious crude double entendre. I'm seducing you. No kidding. What can I say? I'm a passionate and impulsive woman. So how about it? Yeah. Yeah, I guess I am. Good. Yeah, it is. It is good. Did you want to start now? Why don't we finish this section first? Oh, okay. A little musical foreplay. Terrific. speak to about permanently reserving this table? Um, I don't know, a psychiatrist? <laughs> so let, let me try. Call McFlono McFlooniloo. <laughs> Calling Rajesh Kutrapali. <laughs> oh, it's very impressive. <laughs> and a little racist. My friends and I got tired of dancing, so we came over to have sex with you. No, no, don't rush. Jump in the tank. We said no tanks. There are no rules in hell. <laughs> I'm a big med pack. I need a med pack. <laughs> Told ya. Now, uh, there's a sniper. Use your rocket launcher. So all I've got is a needler, and I'm all out of ammo. And now you're out of life. <laughs> Why'd you hit pause? I thought I heard something. What? No, never mind. Sorry, go. 
Give me the phone. Why? Just give it to me. What are you doing? Don't worry, you'll thank me. Hey, Lola, Lita, Raj, good to talk to you. Yes, it is good to talk to you too. So, what are you wearing? Oh, not important. Uh, so, anyhow, when would you like to meet? Friday works for me. And I call you with a time and place. But in the meantime, keep it real, babe. You may now thank me. <laughs> For what, making me sound like a Simpsons character? To life, to life, l'chaim. L'chaim, l'chaim, to life. Life has a way of amusing us, blessing and bruising us. Drink l'chaim to life. I won't believe it, what's gotten into him? Couple virgin Kubali Brays that turned out to be kind of slutty. <laughs> Didn't. Hey, you do your experiments, I do mine. <laughs> Somebody got the whole thing on their cell phone and put it on YouTube. <laughs> what? Now, who would do that? That would be me. <laughs> hey, check it out. It's a featured video. You hit me. You saw that? He hit me. Trying to blow up my head. So it was working. What's that? Work? You are a nutcase. Well, we'll see about that. You people in the front row, heads up. This is a splash zone. Stop it. Quit it. Leonard, code Milky Green. Dear Lord, not Milky Green. Why didn't you just have soup at home? Betty, I have an IQ of 187. Don't you imagine that if there were a way for me to have had soup at home, I would have thought of it? You can have soup delivered. I did not think of that. You know, I kind of feel bad about what we did to him. Yeah, we really ruined his life. <laughs> Screw him, he was weak. Okay, I am setting the dials for January 10th, 2328. Here we go into the future. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Have you ever heard of Schrodinger's cat? Actually, I've heard far too much about Schrodinger's cat. Good. All right, the cat's alive. Let's go to dinner. 